The Hornet is like a cross between a sniper rifle and a shotgun. Note how it takes out two bully moans with one shot from a distance. Right now, you can kill most en enemies with one shot, but if you need more, it has a very fast fire rate and an even faster reload rate. I love where it shoots that one right out of the air. <clears throat> now normally, uh, you go down and go in through the gate of uh, Liarsburg. But I like coming this way where you can look down and get a better shot at these guys. I'm not even shooting all that accurately and still killing them. Not the greatest shot in the world. In fact, you see this guy jumping around. I can't even hit him. <clears throat> but that's not the gun's fault. Oops, out of ammo. I've noticed before that this game is pretty good at giving you ammo if you use it up during a battle. right here, dude. Now that Lyersburg is cleared, I might as well turn on the main power. This town's full of things that may be of use to a go-getting slayer of men like yourself. Minion, roll out! I see our fearless leader Jack is looking for it. Come on, fellow, this is it. I'm scribbling about swinging the peaks of the frontier. You shoot at unclean women and fools like a furious giant. Ah, I'm pushing again on my apologies. Ah, there you are. Ah, come on, work, curse you. Ah, fecal matter. The bounty board's broken. Sure, we'll be doing this again soon enough. 
I used to hide back uh, and shoot these Bullymon from long range with a sniper rifle, but uh, now I can just wade in most of the time with this thing. This is a lot more fun. Please make Captain Flint's death as prolonged as possible, would you? If you're to survive out here for any length of time, you'll need a better shield. I humbly suggest that you visit the old station radio station. You'll need to take the opportunity. I want to do the Bad Hair Day mission first in order to get the better sniper rifle, even though it's not as important now since I've been getting the Hornet. But I'm at level four now. I need to level up to five uh, to activate Death Trap for other missions. And I can do that uh, leveling up along the way. The first opportunity will be uh, shooting down some racks that are flying outside the gate. Welcome, customer. Remember, we're all it's generally a good idea to clear racks out of an area to keep them from attacking you while you are busy with something else. This bunch out here are pretty benign, but uh, they can fly at you. They just don't do as much damage as some later. The safest procedure is to get your back up against the wall or cliff to keep them from hitting you from behind. When they come at you, you have to aim a little above them. This can make it hard to see what you're shooting at, but these guys tend to just fly right into your shots. The level up bar at the bottom of the screen is divided into tenths. We started at 6.25 tenths. And the caption will show how far along the bar we get at each place.
This is a simple mission that we can do sometime back at Lyersburg. Hyperion hasn't digressed any troops from New Haven to pursue us, and a sandstorm has devoured their nearest frontier town. We just did. Oh, damn it! Everyone, get away from the windows! You've discovered one of Helena Pierce's audio logs. She was a lieutenant in the Crimson Raiders, the anti Hyperion resistance wrestler, to know what became of her. If you could find the rest of those audio logs, I would be more than happy to pay you for them. Well, we leveled up, uh, so we'll let uh, Claptrap earn his keep. So we went from uh, 6.25 to just over uh, the next level. So that would be uh, four tenths of a level, just getting this far. This is where we will melee the bully mongs for the bad hair day mission. By keeping our distance, we can snipe them until their health is down to a sliver, which is the point where we can kill them easily. The brat bully mong's health only needs to be down to one fourth, and one melee strike will kill them then. In the past, I've been able to get the brat's health down without killing them by aiming for their legs, but this time that kills them probably because my level is a lot higher than it usually is. The adults can take a lot of direct hits, but then you have to whittle them down by shooting their arms and legs. There are uh, two main defenses uh, to this strategy is uh, sometimes they run back and forth so fast it's hard to aim for them. The other time is a uh, bully mong that's already uh, down to a sliver may get in front of one that you're trying to whittle down and if you're not careful you'll shoot the wrong one. Now that one that uh, has just a small piece of health right there uh, you would think would be uh, good to go but uh, it take quite a few shots to, or strikes to kill him still. So there I shot a, a brat in the leg and it killed him. So then here comes another adult. And again, he's hiding behind some that I don't want to hit, so I have to be careful. That's close enough. Now I'm going to pull out the uh, Hornet in case I get into trouble uh, that I'll have something to get.
get out of trouble with. That area to the left, sometimes uh, bully monks will come out that way. I come over by this hill because that gives me a little cover and then I can run up and attack while they're throwing stuff at me. Since it only takes one shot to hit them, you see my shield and health is down to almost nothing. But even if they kill me, uh, they're all in such bad shape, I would have probably been able to, to hit them and uh, get second wind. But if they back away and you can't move fast, uh, then uh, you don't have any choice but to take out your gun and shoot one that's already been weakened. I got three hair samples, uh, so I've got to go after one more, single them out from the herd because uh, they tend to come together. I'm looking around that way to make sure that nobody's sneaking up on me. Plus, I need to back up so that these guys won't come after me. If I'm just standing where I was before, they, would, they wouldn't stop. Okay, that, that one is good to go, but see, I've got these other guys in the way. And they're running off, so. They'll come back, but it's just a nuisance to have to deal with them. I'd really like to kill the two healthy ones so that I have a free shot at that one, but I can't risk shooting at him and uh, killing him. This gun has such splash damage, I can't be sure of just hitting the guy I want. Okay, he kind of got off to the left, and that opened the door for me. I don't know where that thing went. I didn't think I picked it up, but maybe I did. You could go on around where we were that just kind of loops around and come back to where you were, but it's just a few more bully monks to kill and uh, we don't need the XP and, and uh, we don't need any more fur, so I'm going back to get the rifle. A trillion thanks, Vault Hunter. You've helped a foolish old man look 